Hey guys, hope everybody's doing well. Um, so I have a little package here that just arrived. Um, I got this one from a new company on AliExpress. Um, we, I am reviewing this one for them. So they sent this one to me, at no cost for the product. I just paid shipping for it. Um, the company was amazing to deal with. Their communication was extremely friendly, um, very prompt um, responses to questions. Um, they messaged me back to see if I had gotten, if to let me know that my product had shipped. Any questions I had for them, they responded right away and were extremely friendly to deal with. So I was very impressed by that. Um, they did say they were a new company, um, so they were glad to send me this for a review. So um, it is just a little sample that they had. So the name of the store is Shop 910354147 Store. Hopefully they come up with an easier name than that, but um it is what it is so anyway that's the name of the store i will put a link um in my description um so this one here i let them choose what they wanted to send me so they sent me this little 30 by 30 round um the price for it at the time was five dollars and 40 cents canadian shipping was included so free shipping for this um now i don't blame this for them at all i ordered this on november 23rd they shipped it out the next day um, it arrived in country on the 6th, so it take, took 12 days to get here. However, Canada Post made a boo-boo, and instead of sending it to Saskatchewan, sent it to Manitoba. So it went to Winnipeg and then was rerouted. So it did take a few extra days to get here, but that was not the company's fault. It was Canada Post's error. Um, I never had an issue with it. There was always, uh, like, the shipping update, the tracking number worked. Shipping was great, so I do not fault them for that at all so anyway um let's get into this so this just came in a little bubble mailer i do have a feeling that this is not a true 30 by 30 so but you know it feels really like a good weight so we'll see um this was only available in a round um so that's what i believe i got i guess we'll see so packaging is very nice just a plain mailing envelope there's no extra packaging oh look at that that has a clear cover you guys I was totally not expecting this that's amazing for this price like five dollars and fifty cents clear cover it is definitely not a true 30 by 30 um, that looks more like maybe about a 25 by 25 I don't have my tape measure handy, so I will measure it and I will put that in the description. Um, but it looks like it's more like 30 by 32 from edge to edge. So, But I think that's pretty common. Um, this is actually sealed in its own little envelope. It's all packaged extremely nicely. This is very, very nice presentation. Um, this is like the best I've seen. So let's open this up. We'll get into it looks really cute now it was supposed to be a santa we'll see what they sent me so let's take a peek yeah i think that's what i got it's a very nice canvas very nice canvas yeah that is probably like a 30 by 30 corner to corner so probably more like a 27 by 27 but looks nice there's our canvas wow you guys this is really nice for the price for five dollars that's sweet so we'll take a peek at our toolkit. We just have a standard toolkit here. Um, looks like it came with just a single placer pen. And just the standard green, the small bolt. So very, very standard toolkit. Just a tiny little square of wax. Um, I'm definitely interested in doing a review on a larger project for this company. Um, they had some really nice like abstract designs. Um, some ones that I had not seen before. So um definitely check them out if you're looking for something a little different so we have our drills oh look at this and this is even in a little wow is this ever packaged nicely very very impressive definitely would recommend this company if you're looking for something for a gift or um yeah like something where presentation is important this is this would definitely be high on my list i don't want to ruin the little setup here um let's take out our inventory sheet. Let's see, is it 
folded. Yep, I got a full sheet of paper. That's nice. I like getting the full sheets. So there is our inventory. We have 17 colors on this. And there's our little Santa. So let me see, 17 colors. So we have the numbers. Um, it looks like they've got like the symbols. Those correspond. So like, you know, A is A, B is B. Uh, yeah, and then they did include the DMC numbers, which is nice, and then the amounts as well. Oh, and look at that. There's even a total at the bottom, and then the number of baggies that I should have, and it looks like this might be the weight. Um, I'm not sure what this is. Huh. Interesting. Okay, and then our little baggies. They're all packaged in Ziplocs. That's nice take a peek at some of these so here is this one is 17 so this one here is color 3865 those look very nice so second very very nice quality drills it doesn't look like there's any trash in there that's very nice take another we'll look at a couple other colors here I saw this there's the red. That is such a pretty color. I love that one, you guys. That's so pretty. Very nice looking drills. I haven't done a round in a while, so I'm anxious to do a round. This will be a nice little break. Um, you know, I think that, uh, yeah, this one was only available in a round. So let's take another little baggie out here. No trash in those at all. They're all pre-numbered. That's nice. Yeah, those look really good. I'm very impressed. Very, very, very impressed. Um, I often order diamond paintings for my coworkers, these little gifts and stuff. This will be a company that I will definitely keep in mind if I'm ordering a gift for somebody. The presentation was absolutely perfect. So now the canvas is a nice soft canvas. It is a little thin, um, but it's like fabricy. It's not. It's not paper. Like sometimes when you get a thin canvas, it's papery. Um, and this one isn't. This is definitely a canvas, um, but it is a little thinner. Let's take a look at the glue. It is a poured glue. Uh, looks really good so far. Looks good. Looks good. There's no bubbles or rivers in it. I don't know if you can see that. It looks very nice. Uh, let's see if we can get up to the drill field here. Can get focused on that so there is the training wheels or the guide circles but they're quite light um i don't think you would see those in like if you know it's how sometimes you see them around the diamonds um when i'll do it when i do it i'll see how it looks i'm gonna do a post review on this one too um very nice the symbols are very nice and clear um those ones in the black I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if I can focus on them. Those are a little bit, a little little harder to read, but like they're all the same, so shouldn't be too too bad. But I think if you were dealing with a picture with a lot of dark colors, that might be tricky. Um, but I'm I'm okay with that for this picture. So anyway that is really nice uh, the canvas is like i said it is thin but it is it is um it's actually canvas uh, the, the last than one i worked with was more like paper so um i'm out of focus here i just want to make sure i'm focused perfect okay now that i focus we're going to get up close again so i'm going to have to refocus my camera now there is a little um what do you call those a little barcode up there I'm gonna hold it up there so if you wanted to scan it you could maybe I'll include a picture of that at the end of the video I'm anxious to see what that actually brings up so there is our little thumbnail you guys let's see if I can get there again my camera is not wanting to focus today come on camera focus And our symbols, nice and clear. Like I said, I prefer square, but um, it's not bad for a for a round. So nice, easy symbols to read. There's nothing too crazy. 
anyway guys there we go um so yeah i really like the canvas love the setup of this the only concern that i really have is well first of all the canvas is a little thin but i think it'll be okay um and how dark the colors are but you know besides that for like for five dollars and fifty cents i don't think you could beat this um yeah i'm really happy i would say like for my opinion shipping communication packaging everything so far i am giving this probably a nine out of ten um definitely would recommend this store so far um yeah so anyway guys thank you for checking out this video i'm excited to do this review for this company i will be doing a post review on this picture when i'm done and um yeah guys have a great day talk to you soon Bye bye